Every year, more than 50,000 pedestrians and cyclists are killed, and around 300,000 people get severely injured by motorized transport in Europe. Very often, these accidents happen at night, when the vision of the driver is limited. The driver, therefore, does not always notice the presence of pedestrians in time. Also, animals that cross the streets at night often fall victim to oncoming traffic. Technology, however, makes it possible to considerably reduce the death tolls and the number of injuries caused by motorized transport. One can, for example, increase the visibility of cyclists and pedestrians by applying reflectors on bikes and reflecting strips on clothing. Another solution is to improve the night vision of the driver by making use of an infrared camera. When an infrared camera is mounted in a car, it can capture the energy emitted by warm living objects, independent of ambient light. This way, living objects on the road are immediately visible to the driver, even when they are at a considerable distance and invisible to the naked eye. The driver can therefore anticipate dangerous situations and avoid collisions. Such an infrared camera could, for example, be integrated in the bumper of the car, while the infrared image can be projected on a screen that is mounted on the dashboard. Infrared imaging or infrared cameras are ideally suited for detecting pedestrians in front of the car to alarm the driver before a potential accident. Today, infrared cameras for cars already exist. However, they are very expensive and therefore available only to those who drive high-end cars. In order for them to be spreading into the mass market, the cost has to come down. Otherwise, it will be a product uniquely for, for premium upper segment cars. The know-how and expertise to solve this cost issue is currently available in Europe. Several European research groups and companies have been investigating the possibility to develop a low-cost infrared camera for automotive applications. To accelerate the development of the infrared camera, they joined forces in a consortium under the name of ICU. Financially supported by the European Commission, they are developing this highly advanced safety component for the automotive market at a very affordable price. In order to make a complicated cam camera like this, one, one needs a, a wide range of knowledge and it is very important to be able to uh, cooperate with other people over the whole of Europe who have this specialised knowledge, where we can combine our knowledge and together we can come with a camera with much, much improved performance. The same type of cameras can also find applications in areas other than the automotive. They can, for example, be used for surveillance purposes such as the detection of stowaways in containers. The advantages of being able to uh, recognize any warm uh, object, such as a vulnerable road user, uh, on a long distance is, is of course very interesting. But there are applications in, in any possible field that you can imagine. The primary aim of these infrared cameras, however, remains to make driving at night much safer and more comfortable, and to substantially reduce the number of victims caused by traffic.